So what you really need is a, an effective search strategy to help you find the perfect woman for you without having to date every single one of them. OK. Got one. Optimal stopping theory, it's called. That is not what I thought you were going to say. <laughs> OK. Um, so it was invented in 1875 by a chap called Arthur Cayley, essentially to, to gamble better. And two Harvard mathematicians worked out the best chance you can give yourself of stopping on the one, the perfect woman for you, is to spend the first 37% of your dates just kind of not taking them too seriously, having a nice time, getting a bit of a feel for the marketplace and so on. And then after that 37% period has passed, you should then pick the next woman to come along that is better than everybody that you've seen before. And if you do that, you're maximising your chances, mathematically, of finding the perfect woman for you. And what will the chances be of the one after 37%, that one, being the right woman for well, me? Okay, well, OK, so if you pick somebody completely at random in your list of 100 and just chose that person to go on your date with, your chance of getting the best person in your list would be 1%, right? 1 in 100. But this technique, just having that little rejection phase of 37% at the beginning, means that you increase your chances all the way from 1% to 37%. If the number of potential dates N for Zand is 100, his chance of success P is highest when he rejects 37% of potential partners. His success rate drops off if he either reduces or increases his rejection phase R the time before he starts thinking seriously about a match. OK, that is an amazing bit of maths. That, that is extraordinary. So, imagine you decide to take 100 people, uh, reject the first 37 of them, and then pick the next person who comes along that's better than everyone that you've seen before, and take that person on a date. Wow. OK, so 100 people seems reasonable. Yeah, yeah I can crazy. entertain 100 yeah, people. Of OK, so I just start two, three, four. Are there some of these that you would swipe right to? This person I would definitely swipe right for. <laughs> she looks lovely. And according to you, I have to reject her because you told me to. So, like, this person seems nice. Yeah, nope, seems get rid of them. Yeah. So you carry on swiping left for the entire time and then you end up, well, probably dying alone. <laughs> <laughs> nursing a deep hatred of mathematical formulas. <laughs> and mathematicians. Yeah, probably. Um, you and the two guys at Harvard, <laughs> primarily. Um.